apprentices are all around us. Working in our towns and cities, supporting businesses, organizations and communities, all whilst gaining invaluable experience and qualifications. Apprentices are amazing. We work on the latest automotive technology. We work towards the conservation of endangered animals. We care for our local communities. We build the places you care about. We cut and style your hair. We fight fires, we respond to emergencies, and we save lives. We produce your TV shows. We support scientists doing groundbreaking research. We install electrical infrastructure. We promote and market your businesses. We manufacture your favourite products. And make sure they are the best they can be. We even work in Parliament. Discover the world of apprenticeships. My name's Ben, I'm an apprentice at Amazon Sustainability. I'm doing a level four corporate responsibility and sustainability apprenticeship. What I love most about my apprenticeship is the ability to go into a workplace and learn and earn at the same time. Doing an apprenticeship, I felt like I could gain much more of that hands-on experience, which would be much more beneficial in my early career. Hi, I'm Jaina and I'm a project management degree apprentice at Leonardo. I chose to be an apprentice because I like the idea of working whilst I learn. I felt it was the best way for me to develop myself educationally, but also professionally. My name's Abby, I'm a technical apprentice at Leonardo. I'm doing a technical apprenticeship, which is a level three advanced apprenticeship. Uh, my advice to others would definitely be to consider an apprenticeship. There's a great working environment and social aspects, and you're also gaining a qualification.
Hi, my name is Ray Sawa and I'm doing a convincing apprenticeship at Hannes Listers based in Luton. My apprenticeships were more appropriate for myself compared to something like university since I'm more of a hands-on person. I have a personal tutor, it's like online university. I sent her in an assignment and she'll mark that assignment and give me feedback. That really helps me, not only online, but then I can use that and apply that in my work environment as well. My name is Eddie Forster. I work for GEA Mechanical Equipment UK and my job role is apprentice engineer. There's a lot of practical knowledge that you gain from an apprenticeship while you're studying. That means you've got actual physical working experience and a degree and you can build yourself from there. My name is Carly Maguire. I'm an Accounts Officer for the House of Commons in the Finance, Performance and Portfolio team and I'm based here in Westminster. I am doing the AAT Level 4 Diploma in Accounting, which is the professional level. My course specifically is Distance Learning, so my training provider is based up in Birmingham and then I do my classes and all my revision online. Hi, my name is Cyril. I'm a Business Degree Apprentice here at Leonardo. My training provider is the University of Hertfordshire, so I attend there one day a week. And the whole idea is you learn for a day at university and then you implement that in the workplace. My name is Curtis Littleford, I am an apprentice chef and I work for Rothamsted Enterprises. I am doing a level two chef apprenticeship. So the benefits of doing an apprenticeship is you can learn while work at the same time. You can learn from experienced people and colleagues and you can also have fun while doing it too. Hi, my name's Eugene Gillespie. My name's Neve Talbot. Hi, my name's Jasper and Bazra. We are maintenance engineers at Stellantis Group, also known as Vauxhall. And we are doing a mechatronics apprenticeship. The study programme is much more practical based than it is theory, so it is a lot more hands-on. And by your second year, you get to learn with the people who actually do the job already. Kelby Diane Murray and I'm doing the Nurse and Associate Apprenticeship within the NHS. I would recommend a apprenticeship for nursing as it takes the stress off you having to pay back a student loan. My name is Tyler, I work for Sparshets Truck and Van. I'm doing a level three heavy vehicle apprenticeship. So literally I finished my GCSEs on the 14th of June 2019 I believe. And then a week later I was at, I was at the new depot and I, I remember my first day walking in and as I said I saw a truck and I was like yeah this is what I want to do for the rest of my life. My name's Kyra Salik, I am an Energy Efficiency Officer and I'm doing the Level 4 Associate Project Management Apprenticeship. I studied Environmental Science at university and then progressed from there really. I'm Michael Aylott, I live in Hertfordshire and I'm doing a Carpentry Apprenticeship, MVQ Level 2. So I work for a company called MP Build, they're based in Letchworth and it's sort of like a general construction company, they do design and build and I've been working for them for about four years and started my apprenticeship after two years of working with them. I'm... My name is Alex Sosick, so I work at the University of Cambridge in the Gurdon Institute and I'm doing a Management and Leadership Level 5 apprenticeship. I lead a team of about five people who have very different skills, so I thought it would be an advantage to actually learn how to actually manage properly, how to manage my team and how to manage uh, projects and uh, the working environment. My advice to others who are considering apprenticeships are do it. I'm a firm believer that you don't have to go to university to get a good job to be someone to get somewhere. You can do this through other avenues. The great thing about apprenticeships are you can earn while you're working and learning what you're doing. The advice that I would give to students and parents is to really research the work you want to start your career in. It will give you much more clarity and in turn it will make your career much more enjoyable. My advice would be 
Do something that you, you enjoy doing, something that you love, like I'm doing. My advice would be, if you are thinking about an apprenticeship, go for it. If you have a passion and you don't think that you'll be able to do it, and you have that opportunity, go for it. Take the opportunity and do everything that you can to, to do it, because it is possible.